It's not easy being green. There are so many tips, it can be confusing to know which ones work and which ones don't. But before you throw in the towel, check out these 30 things that you can do to help stop waste and also save you some money along the way from facetransformation.com. Unplug your blow dryer after using it. Appliances like this suck up energy even when they're off, so you'll save energy and money by unplugging. Install a low flow shower head. You can save up to 750 gallons of water per month, meaning a cheaper water bill, and new versions of these shower heads still feel luxurious. Take a canvas bag with you shopping and not just to the grocery store. You'll use a lot less plastic bags. Precycle, as in recycle before you buy, by looking for products with less packaging. If you're feeling ambitious, send an email to your favorite brands and ask them to use less packaging. Always look at any containers you have to see if they can be recycled even your beauty products before trashing them. Try some eco-friendly beauty products as alternatives to your standard products. You may even like them better. Avita uses many natural ingredients and limited packaging and there are plenty of organic beauty brands. Look through your current stash of beauty products and check for these ingredients. All are known to potentially harm your health and the environment. Try an organic mouthwash instead of your regular one. Many mouthwashes contain formaldehyde and sodium lauryl sulfates, which aren't good for you or the environment. The next time you buy a toothbrush, try to find one that's recyclable and reuse the one you're done with by using it to clean around the house or even brush your eyebrows. Just wash it thoroughly first. Skip those dryer sheets when doing the laundry. Most contain harmful chemicals. Instead, put a few drops of your favorite essential oil on a cloth and toss it in with the dryer load for clothes that smell great and aren't coated in chemicals. Find out if your lipstick has lead in it. Install energy efficient light bulbs in your bathroom and anywhere else in your home if you can. You'll save energy and cash. Try mixing hydrogen peroxide and baking soda for an eco-friendly whitening toothpaste. Just don't swallow it and rinse after using. Do your kids have lice? Instead of using an expensive and potentially toxic lice shampoo, Try using a spoonful of tea tree oil poured into a spray bottle of water. In the shower, shut off the water while shaving your legs and you can save 300 gallons of water per month. Try using a sunscreen with physical blockers like zinc oxide or titanium dioxide instead of a chemical one. Many sunscreens contain chemicals that can be harmful to you and the environment. Steer clear of antibacterial products that contain triclosan because bacteria are becoming resistant to these products and stronger bacteria are developing. This can lead to worldwide health problems. In most cases soap and water is just as effective. Find out which brands are committed to producing safer products. Switch from a petroleum-based lip balm, which is made from oil, a non-renewable resource, and try one made from beeswax or shea butter instead. Are you allergic to a variety of products? Try using fragrance-free options. Currently, the FDA allows brands to classify many ingredients under the term fragrance. Turn off the water while brushing your teeth and you can save 25 gallons of water a month. Didn't like the peach blush you bought? If you can't return it, don't throw it out. 
give it to a friend or mix it with other colors to create a whole new shade. You can try this with nail polish and lip products too. Don't just toss last season's nail polish in the trash. Take it to a hazardous waste disposal so it doesn't get into groundwater and harm the environment. Can't recycle that moisturizer bottle? Try reusing it to store other products or things around your home. Keep a bucket or large bowl in your shower and catch the water as it warms up. You can use it to water plants. Instead of buying chemical filled products, try natural homemade recipes. Find a salon that uses proper ventilation and green beauty products to protect you from harmful chemicals. Chemicals from aerosol hairsprays, hair dye, and perm solutions and nail polish can all be dangerous. Try buying organic produce and meat whenever you can. You'll help lessen pesticides in the environment and be healthier. And better overall health means you'll have better looking skin and hair. Try using eco-friendly makeup brushes, ones made with sustainable bamboo handles and animal-free bristles. Buy less. Sure, it's fun to have a different lip gloss for every day of the week, but buying only what you need or use regularly saves packaging and products from ending up in the trash. These were just quick, tiny ways you can reduce your carbon footprint and start helping the globe today. Spread this around to your friends by clicking the like button below and let them know about these 30 things they can do to help the globe. Thanks for watching.